Good evening, everybody. It is technically Friday. I am Frankie from shortpause.com. And uh, tonight we're doing a uh, midnight launch party. I haven't hosted one of these since probably the disastrous Dishonored 2. So, uh, <laughs> uh, obviously, uh, I'm going to be checking out Little Nightmares. Uh, this is available right now on PlayStation 4, Xbox Live. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's also on PC. It's $20 if you want to buy it digitally and play it right now as well. Or uh, if you're into uh, physical games like myself, uh, there's a uh, retail version that's also available right now. Uh, there's about a $15 price difference, but uh, I think you get some cool stuff with the physical version. I know the PlayStation version comes with a soundtrack, but it's like a downloadable code for a PlayStation you know, soundtrack. So if you figured out how to export that stuff, by all means, go for it. It's finally happened. Look, I've been looking forward to playing this game for a while now, so. Reviews uh, came out last week, very stellar. So I'm excited to get in here and check this one out. <clears throat> My brain is like, just not functioning anymore. So if I'm not figuring out something stupid obvious, just uh, feel free to yell at me. Load times are uh, pretty lengthy, it seems. looking Ooh. all right so let's see a jumps Oh, I have a lighter. All right. So B uh, pulls out a lighter. Why do anything? Why does it do anything? Alright, so B's the lighter. Can I jump with the lighter? You can jump with the lighter. Uh, Alright, I trigger crap stuff. No, is there no. Alright, so L2 crouches.
looks like the lady you saw in that It's a doll? Carry it around. I'm just assuming that since this looks like the lady we saw that you need her for something. chair floating on the ceiling? Am I just not lining this up right? Or? Oh, I gotta grab. Okay. There's a chair suspended from the ceiling. Highly sprung. Oh, that's dark. Can you read that? I probably can't pick it up because I'm stupid and pushed a chair over it. Can I pick it up anyways? Like, no, probably not. That was what's trapped. Get up on there. You gotta hold down the trigger to hold on to things while you're climbing, it seems. Ugh! Oh no, oh no! Oh, okay, that's bad. very like limbo inside type of vibe to it <clears throat> all right are, are we just right back yeah we're right back where we were all right well let's not let's not have the snake fall on us this time Oh, oh no. Another one crawling on the floorboard back there? Ugh. That's right. Don't fall down here. Uh, now you just yank 
this up? Yeah, I can. Oh, what is that thing? Oh, no. Ugh. Oh, my God. Oh, no. So watch out for the floorboard. Or just, yeah. Oh man, there's so many of them. Oh my god, this is horrible. Oh, oh god. Stay in there, don't follow me. Are you? I don't trust myself. I don't trust myself. I don't trust myself. Some snoring. on that or not. No. That's an obvious no. Man, this lighter, man. <laughs> this is not efficient <laughs> to light the way. I got a couple seconds of light, but from where? Am I just supposed to... No. Am I gonna make it? Ah, oh, no. Hmm. Is there something laying around I can use to prop the door open? I just didn't see. Light in here, I guess. Gotta be something I didn't see. Hold X. Oh, yeah, that's right. I can run. Duh. you Ugh. And curiosity killed the cat it's probably gonna kill me numerous times but you know oh well, this seems safe what are you what yeah that looks great I assume these serve as checkpoints. Hey, there's the logo of the game. Surely this is a bad place to be in. Looks like some kind of 
electricity next door or something. I assume something's going on with this wiring stuff, right? It's probably something behind the door that I can't see. No, come back. Should I chase him? Why not? Credit toilet paper is just always a lifesaver, you know what I'm saying? Oh, that's uh Yeah. Why is this not a timer? To oh, okay. I assume that it's just like that. Oh that's creepy. Electricity's back on. Probably walking through there will murderize me. You're a train. Too sure what I'm supposed to do here. I imagine. Like I'll probably like. Oh, okay. So you can get kind of back and forth between rooms this way. Why would I want to go back in there though? Is there a reason I'd want to go back over there? Probably not.
And if that's why it sends you back to the other side, because it knows that you're going to need to shut off another light. I feel like there's an unusual amount of stuff you can interact with in this room. What is this? I was just like rolling all over the place back there. What is it? Nope. Just bounced my face off the dresser. Can't tell half the time if I'm under the thing I'm trying to jump on or. to want to jump up to another level of this, right? Or is there? Yeah, probably not. I feel like this is gonna fall on me if I walk underneath it. Oh no! Yeah, this kind of has like an inside vibe to it. Oh, there's the light. Okay, so it's up above. Alright, so. Ooh. Oh, you can slide! Nice. Something laying around I need to drag over here. Hopefully, it's not whatever that is. Is that a kid? It's probably a kid. Don't feel like that's a jump I'm gonna make. There's gotta be something later on that I should probably drop. 
drive over here. Hopefully it's not that kid. I know what that is. Like, I don't feel like it makes me jump higher. Like, if you hit X, it does this pose thing. Well, let me see what. I wonder if I was supposed to drag something from the other room out here and I just didn't see it. That's always a possibility. missing <clears throat> I assume there's no something around here that I should probably have Blocks really gonna help in the grand scheme of things. Can I lug this mattress over? <laughs> oh yeah, X makes you run, so I assume that's just like a run position. I don't know. No, you don't see me. I wonder if I can climb those cages. that maybe that's maybe I can like somehow climb around and get over there didn't think to try that Wait here a second, because sometimes it likes to jump over to the, just the end. Supposed to ignore the little bird thing? Oh. 
Whoa, what the hell? Alien isolation all over again. What is that? Why is there a baby in that bed? What was that? What was that thing? That's uh not good. Guess I need to eat. Thanks, lady. That was, uh, really weird. All right. Uh, yeah, that's not totally dark. There's a random noose in the middle of the room. I wonder if I can light it on fire. Yeah, probably not. I don't know why. Guess I'll just set that there for now. I don't. I don't know. Well, this is decorating on it too. Well, you can jump off of them. Sounded good. So 
So I don't think these are checkpoints because I lit one of these already and it didn't uh, like checkpoint me or anything. Oh my god, oh my god, what have I done? Oh yes, okay, so if you let go of the trigger, you're gonna fall uh, to your death. So, uh, yeah, I, I figured that'd happen. Just wanted to uh, test my theory out and see if it was true. Wow. Yeah, so I'm guessing those little things you're lighting aren't checkpoints. I wonder if I can turn the shower on. Can I turn the shower on? Oh, there's one of those snakes up there. See it? See it? Gross. Rude. I'm surprised there's only one. I'm surprised I didn't notice it in the first place. Because that's exactly what I was looking for before. I don't know if I need to move this or not. I just moved it out of habit before. I don't know. Oh, that's probably bad. Now whatever's going to probably run in here and murder me. There's my thing I lit. Oh no! Oh, thank God. So, knowing my luck, I'm just gonna plummet to my death again. Can I pick this ladder up? I just have like a really strong feeling that I'm gonna need that ladder somewhere else. I don't think I can move it. Grinder. I don't get the feeling I really want to turn that thing on, but I feel like I have to. supposed to ride on this thing? What happens if I let go? Oh yeah, that's a possibility. Let's ram it into this wall and see what happens.
Ooh. Is this another dragon pull out? No. Oh, oh boy. Still not really sure what the point of lighting these things is. What is this thing? Freeing those things. It's gonna be fun. Ooh. Oh, yeah. All right. Yeah. Great. Just what I wanted the noose. I see him. I don't really want to be in there. I don't know. That's where I came in. So gross. Ugh. My God, they're already everywhere. Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! Mm. Oh, it's the same room I was already in. Creepier. Oh, right, because I turned off the uh, electricity. Oh, yeah, that's 
Well, oh, that's creepy. Back your janitor card. Oh, this will be fun to try to stay behind. Please don't make me run through the shower again. Dude, those slug things, man, they just ugh, ugh. make my skin crawl. Oh no! Poor timing! Poor timing! Poor timing! Poor timing! I figured if it was following the card, it wouldn't turn around. Honest mistake. Alright. Not falling for it this time. Well, that was almost really bad. No. Oh. Yeah, this is definitely not worse. I feel like this is a logical ending point. Depending what happens. On the plus side, I think this just shot me over 14,000 gamer score, so that's pretty rad. Been slowly rebuilding. So, that's cool. Alright, I think once this, uh, once this loads us in here, we'll, uh, take a quick peek around the area and, uh, call it a night. very unnerving vibe to this game like ugh. slug things man they're just ugh. put them in a damp wet draining room just ugh. these load times are killer I'll tell you what So I gather we're on a ship or something, maybe, because there's a lot of swaying, you know, I've noticed as we're making our way through the game here. Ooh. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, we're going to call it a night here uh, again, obviously, Little Nightmares. Uh, this is available now. It's on pretty much any platform. That's not the Switch, unfortunately. Uh, it's $20 if you want to go the digital route, $35 if you're a physical person. 
uh, which of course, you know, Gamers Club from Best Buy or Amazon Prime currently is 20% off, so $27.99. Uh, I should have my PS4 version here sometime next week, but I really wanted to hop into this game, so I uh, sprung for an Xbox version as well to uh, to handle the stream tonight. So, um, yeah, uh, if you're not familiar with us, uh, like I've said at the beginning of the stream, I'm Frankie from shortpause.com. Uh, you could follow us on Twitter at the short pause. Uh, if you like what you see here, uh, this of course uh, streamed on our Twitch channel, uh, twitch.tv slash short pause live. Um, we we try to stream uh, you know throughout the week, um, every Tuesday night over on our YouTube channel. Uh, search for short pause gaming on YouTube. Um, ben Boyce, aka Piccolo nine thirty, uh, picks an indie game release that week. Fires it up on the Tuesday Night Indie Spotlight. That's at 10, 10 p.m. Eastern Time every Tuesday night. Uh, this past uh, past Tuesday night, he fired up uh, Specter, uh, Specter of Torment. I hope that's the name of it. It's the new Shovel Knight expansion. I think it's Specter of Torment. I'm, t- I'm a terrible person, but <laughs> uh, there was that. Uh, Bender uh, got to stream some of What Remains of Edith Finch. So, um, yeah, I mean, if you... Uh, if you're curious to uh, see some of these newer, newer indie games releasing. Uh, you know we got you covered, uh, especially the ones that we find uh, to be very intriguing and definitely worth checking out and letting people see, so they can, uh, you know, decide if it's something they want to hop into. So hopefully, uh, you know, this, uh, this give you a good taste of what Little Nightmares is. If you're in a limbo inside any of the uh, Play Dead games, this is very much one of those. It's very unnerving. Uh, there's a lot of a little more involved you know you obviously gotta hold down the trigger to hold on to things while you're climbing uh that that goes while you're climbing too if you let go of that trigger you're gonna fall um i don't know uh i don't know what i'm doing like i don't know what lighting these little uh uh lanterns is doing and yeah, they're obviously not serving as checkpoints um so i don't know a lot of mystery around this game i want to uh keep playing it find out uh exactly what's going on here uh that's that the girl tossing you the bread dude that was just what <laughs> so i don't know what's going on um but this game is uh really cool really unnerving and like i said if you're a fan of limbo fan of any of those uh play dead games where you're just kind of going there's no spoken dialogue you're just solving some puzzles having a good time doing it you're gonna enjoy this game so again on behalf of shortpause.com i am frankie thank you for checking out little nightmares with me and i'll talk to you guys next week Later.